First tonight at 10, the Omicron variant is now here in Indiana. The Department of Health announced today the variant was detected in a test sample from an unvaccinated Hoosier. The sample was collected on December 9th with the results released just this weekend. According to the CDC, there are now just four states where the variant has not been detected. Now, the map has not yet been updated since Indiana reported its first case. The Omicron variant was first detected here in the U.S. on December 1st. Health officials expect it to become the dominant variant of the virus. Cases are doubling almost every two to three days. Right now, Delta is still the dominant variant. It makes up 99% of samples collected this month. Now, to compare, the Delta variant was first detected here in Indiana back in June. It became the dominant variant in the state by July 9th. Tonight, Fox 59's Max Lewis has reaction from health officials about the impact here in Indiana. Omicron is here and here to stay. We are anxious about the coming months. The Indiana Department of Health says a sample collected from an unvaccinated patient on December 9th is the first documenting case of Omicron in the Hoosier state. That sample was sequenced and the results just came back this weekend. So we know that COVID is still out there. We know that it's still spreading. With Christmas just six days away, health officials say they expect to see cases rise. In the last couple of weeks, we've had about 60% more patients in the IC, in, in the hospital, and it's more than doubled in the ICU. That we're going to have more spread as, get, as people get together. Dr. Christopher Belcher with Ascension St. Vincent says people should still take precautions when seeing family this year. I know, you know, people like to see their extended families, but try to keep it as small as possible. Um, I don't expect masking very much, but distancing would be nice in a gathering. Indiana's hospitals are full with patients from COVID and other illnesses we see this time of year. COVID patients are mostly the unvaccinated, and it's unclear how much more the health systems can take. So our worry is that here we've got an Omicron variant that's emerging. We've got other viruses that are circulating, and on top of this, we have COVID. And as always, the doctors say the best way to stay out of the hospital and more importantly, stay alive is to get vaccinated. If you get a booster shot today or this weekend, you are much better off than you would have been without a booster shot. In Indianapolis, I'm Max Lewis, Fox 59 News.